know us. You know, uh, Look at my diamonds, they dancing. They dancing. Petro Cup paint is the fashion. This is what I'm talking about. This is exactly what I'm talking about. You need guys with edge. You need guys with just not afraid to come out and say exactly what needs to be said. And I just sit in the corner with their arms folded like some little Percy schoolgirl scared to, you know, get out and, you know, speak their mind. No, absolutely not. You need a guy like Lord Pierce. You beat the Spurs. Okay, you beat the freaking Spurs and then turn around and lose to the Bulls? The Bulls? Come on, dog. Can't let that ride. Cannot let that ride whatsoever. And I'm glad Lord Pierce did this. I'm glad that he did this. I love this young Hawks team. But when you beat the Spurs and then turn around and lose to the Bulls? Bro. Come on. Unforgivable. I don't care about who scored how many points. I don't care about Trey being one of the best young superstars in the league. All right? Yes, I said superstar. Fight me, all right? Trey is that damn good. But this team has a long way to go. Because things like this cannot happen. It leads to bad habits. It leads to things and that happens to, you know, us in the city. You know, the Bulldogs lost to South Carolina. Braves lost to the Cardinals. Falcons losing to everybody and their mama. Like, come on. This is what leads to these types of issues. So Lord Pierce saying no positives and a loss to the Bulls? The Bulls, dog? Come on, man. Come on. This is absolutely insane for the Atlanta Hawks to lose to the Bulls. You're better than this. Cam Reddish. Look, man, there's been an incident with teams throwing, uh, the coach throwing chairs, and I absolutely love it. Falcons fans should love this type of stuff. Looking at Dan Quinn, Mike Smith, these guys, look, I love them. And maybe they have an edge outside. But sometimes you need to throw a chair. Sometimes you need to smack a beach. You know what I'm saying? This is exactly what you need to do. Sometimes you need to, you know, raise your voice. Fight. You need to do that. Sometimes you need to fight on the court. Sometimes you need to fight on the field. Push a guy. Do this and do that. Scream at your teammates. Show some edge. And this is what I love from Lloyd Pierce. This is what builds champions. And yes, it's all cool to have a guy who's mild-mannered, you know. You know, he's just going to do the right thing. And he's going to say the right stuff. Yeah, that's all good. And that's what I'm about for the most part. But if you want to win championships in the league, if you want to be an NBA champion, you got to do this. Exactly what Lord Pierce did. And I love it. No positives and a loss, okay? No positives and a loss to the Bulls after beating the Spurs. You can't have these drop-offs. Can't whatsoever. So, Atlanta Hawks fan, let me know what you guys think about this, man. Was Lloyd Pierce right when he said there's no positives in a team loss to the Bulls after beating one of the best teams in the NBA? And where are coach teams in the NBA? Okay? Let me know what you got. Because this is Popovich team. You beat a Popovich coach team and you lose to the Bulls? Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Let's be real. This is unacceptable. Unacceptable. And it leads to bad habits. You don't want these guys, you know, beating, you know, LeBron James, LA Lakers, or, you know, the once, once, um, go to state Warriors. You don't want that to happen. And now you have that happening? Come on, bro. Can't happen. Nope. This stuff can't happen. You got to destroy the teams that you should destroy. Because if you don't, like I said before, it leads to bad habits. Bad habits create losers. Nope. Never be satisfied with a loss. Never be happy with a loss. Get out there and grind. Beat the teams that you should be, and everything will be fine. But like I said before, I love Trey. I love Trey Day. I love Cam. I love John Collins, all these guys, what they got going on. I love it. But at the same time, bro, no. Can't have it. Can't have it. You cannot have it. Lord Pierce, you did your thing. I'm happy. I'm satisfied. And if anybody has anything to say about this, that Lord Pierce was absolutely wrong, you don't know nothing about sports, dog. 
And this is what creates losing mentalities. Everybody's okay with losing. And that's why this city has only had two championships. And one recently by uh, Atlanta United. All right, so let me know what you guys think about this, man. Leave your comments below. Your boy, man, Mike is out, man. Peace. Whipping the Prince of Diana. Double cup bling, found her. Oh, my old God.